You want to disable any other network enabled devices uh, because it may cause issues and conflicts with IPs and whatnot. And also whenever you're using a web-based server uh, or a web-based software, your computer will almost always choose the, the Ethernet adapter that gives you uh, internet access, so, which will mean that you will almost never have access to whatever web device you're trying to communicate with. So we're going to right click, come go into the properties, Ethernet protocol. We're going to change this to a static IP address. Now our static IP address is just going to be 192.168.0.0. Dot one. Um, I know this just because in the we're just okay all this right here. In the documentation, it calls out that the new IP address will be set to uh, 192.168.0.254 for the uh, Phoenix device. Boom. We logged in. Here we have access to the web browser, uh, and we just opened up Google Chrome to be able to do, utilize this. Just an FYI, the purpose of this video is not necessarily a super exploratory video. This video is about getting this device online as quickly as possible.